A 20-mile police chase ends with a crash in Bradley County. Luckily, the deputy involved was not injured, and the suspect is now behind bars at the Bradley County Jail. That's where News Channel Line's Makaya Thurman joins us now live. Makaya. PM, right at this I-75 South 40 mile marker. Trooper Kevin Hopp was in the process of stopping a car when he says a Dodge Dakota swerved into him. Police say the driver of that Dodge was Scott Mullis of Chattooga County. Trooper Hopp took off and began trying to catch up with Mullis. He finally did a few miles up the road. Troopers say the driver continued south into Bradley County, where even more troopers and deputies were standing by with spike strips. Though they deployed the strips at the 27th and 23rd mile marker, both were unsuccessful. But troopers say it was exit 20 where Mullis decided to pull off and quickly get back on the interstate. Just three miles up the road, Bradley County Deputy Colby Duckett was parked in his patrol cruiser. With traffic starting to pick up, troopers say Mullis lost control of his Dodge and crashed into the deputy's car. And that story from Micaiah Thurman. Now, that deputy is said to be okay. Mullis is being charged with DUI and several felony charges and has been taken to the Bradley County Jail.